Welcome to A State of Sight. I'm Isaac Porter and this is your update in ophthalmology and eye care from Raleigh. Today I would like to explain some alternative treatments for dry eye syndrome. Because this is a very common problem, it can be very irritating and bothersome for the patients that have it. Beyond just using artificial tear drops or maybe medicated drops or ointments, there are several other treatments that we can use that can make patients more comfortable. One that I think is a great solution, especially for patients that have severe dry eyes, are moisture chamber goggles. Now, if you look for different things online, you can see onion goggles or onion glasses. And what these are are a pair of glasses that have foam behind the rim of the glasses that sits against the skin around the eyes that makes a little bit of a seal. Now, this helps keep moisture in the eyes. It decreases the amount of air flowing around the eyes and by doing that it can make the eyes much more comfortable than uh, just wearing regular glasses or if people are not wearing anything around their eyes. Uh, if you look you can see um, different versions of these. Um, motorcycle glasses are along the same lines uh, for people riding motorcycles so they don't have so much air passing by their eyes and I think it can be a great solution. Some of the onion glasses are not very attractive. Some patients mostly prefer to wear them around the house because they can may, uh, look a little bit unusual, uh, but they can be very good to increase the comfort. And uh, this is also good sometimes when patients are flying in airplanes where the air is very dry to help keep their eyes more comfortable. Uh, along these same lines, other people can try to control their environment to make their eyes more comfortable. Uh, now is the winter time here in North Carolina. It's been really cold and so we're running heat and the air is very dry. So by increasing the humidity, whether with a humidifier or some people can hook it into their HVAC system to increase the humidity through their whole house or building, uh, this can make people's eyes more comfortable because they'll be drying out less. Uh, also trying to control how much air is blowing on their face or around their eyes. So trying to minimize the use of fans or if you're in your car and your eyes are becoming more dry, try to, try to decrease how much air is blowing towards your face uh, can also make people get some improvement. Um, beyond that, uh, especially for patients that have blepharitis, warm compresses and eyelid scrubs can be very helpful. Uh, with this, uh, there's a lot of new things available like gel packs that can be reheatable and reusable that contain gel or beads that can get pretty warm and then give a nice um, warming effect to the oils in the eyelids so they can flow better and move better. Uh, if you have any other questions about dry eye syndrome or other possible treatments, please post. We'll be happy to answer them and hopefully see you again soon next time on A State of Sight.